I'm so embarrassed. How you doing? <laughs> How am I doing? Not good. This is bad, guys. So I went to school. Got a master's degree in textiles, apparel, and uh, yeah, I cannot conquer merino wool. Nope, definitely can't. It has failed me. I bought this really expensive sweater. My dad convinced me to buy this really expensive sweater from the store in Ireland. I spent $100 on this sweater, got it home, tried it on, took like a picture, sent it to my dad being like, hey, here's my new sweater. And uh, yeah, put it in the wash. He told me I could wash it with Woolite. Didn't have Woolite. I washed it with Dreft. I thought, all right, Dreft is like soft. It's like newborn Dreft or whatever. So I washed it with that and yeah, washed it on cold. What cycle? I don't know. I don't know what cycle I washed it on. It was probably just normal cycle. Put it in the dryer, but I did it on no heat in the dryer and it wasn't in there for very long. Um, yeah, took it out. It shrunk. <laughs> I'm embarrassed. I'm so embarrassed. I don't understand this, guys. Why did it shrink? Why do bad things happen to good people? So I really wanted to wear it today, but I'm wearing this old sweater that my parents gave me. I think this is also from Ireland. They got me this, or they gave this to me. I'm pretty sure it's from like the 70s. So anyway, I thought I would do a video today to show you guys how to um, fix a sweater that you shrunk in the wash. I'm so embarrassed. This is so awful. What did all that schooling go to? I went to ruining a sweater. I don't know if I'm ready to do this. <laughs> what if I fail? What if this sweater is so ruined that it's beyond repair? All right, let's go do this. So I was looking online on how to fix a merino wool that shrunk and I found a YouTube video. The Today Show did a YouTube video on simple hacks on how to unshrink a sweater. I'm going to follow these hacks. Basically, what you need is conditioner, hair conditioner, and some lukewarm water and a bowl. And you put it in a bowl, you soak it for like, I don't know how long they soaked it for, for a while until it all got soaked through, maybe? I don't know, I guess I should <laughs> read directions. I would just like to say that this place that I ordered this sweater from, they had absolutely no directions on how to wash the sweater. So, there's that. But I should, I mean, that's not an excuse. I went to school for this. I should know. Tablespoon of hair conditioner, a large bowl with lukewarm water, and you stir in the conditioner until, it's, until it dissolves. I guess the conditioner relaxes the fibers, guys. And you soak it for 30 minutes. Okay, so... I soak it for 30 minutes in this conditioner water because apparently it's like hair, right? Because it's wool. Yeah. And then you lay it out on a towel and you stretch it. Okay, I can do that. Wow, they stretched it and it looks really good. Good job. And then you let it air dry. So this will be a video that lasts over a couple of span of a few days. Oh, look at her. She's all dancing and happy that she... Uh, fixed her sweater. So maybe that'll be me. That'll be me in the end. I'll be all like, yeah, check out my new sweater. The problem is I bought this sweater and it has a zipper. And when the sweater shrunk, <laughs> the zipper didn't. The zipper didn't shrink, guys. So the zipper is all puffy. And so this would have been a great sweater if I was pregnant because it puffs like right in my stomach. Oh, yeah, she. My son went to the bathroom. I gotta go clean him up. Okay, I'll be right back. Okay, so I'm gonna show you guys the sweater. <laughs> Let's go upstairs. Oh, bed's not made. That's embarrassing. Hey, buddy. How come you didn't make my bed? No, not into it? He's such a good boy. So that's my cat. His name is Bacardi, but we changed it to Cardi because I felt it was kind of weird.
that my kids would be calling the cat Bacardi. So now it's Cardi. I got him when I was 21. Okay, anyway, so here's the sweater. It's hanging up to possibly stretch it out, but I don't think any amount of stretching is really going to um, help it out here, but yesterday I put it on and John was like pulling my arm and stuff but it's still super short. So I'm gonna put it on and you guys are gonna see how small it is, cause it is really, it's really small. Okay, hang on a second. Put you down, wait, is it still recording? Yeah, put you down for a sec. Okay. What are you doing, Cardi? You're looking so cute. Look at him, guys. How cute is this kitty? Hey, buddy. Oh, you're such a cutie pie. All right, so here's the sweater. Here it is. See, it's not, it's not awful, but it definitely shrunk. Like, look at how short the sleeves are. Anybody else have this problem? I guess maybe my arms are really long. I feel like they're not, but like, look at that. And then, yeah, it's definitely short. And the hood, it, the hood completely shrunk to the point where I, can, I don't even think I could get my head in here. Does it get in there? No, like that's sad. Like, look at that, guys. That's just sad. And then I gotta show you the zip. The zipper. First of all, the zipper is not that great. I like could hardly get it on before I even washed it, but it's fine. Let's see if I can get it. Oh, I got it, okay. So as you can see, it like, bulges here. Can't really get, oh, I can get my hands in. It's not awful, but it's definitely not perfect. So in retrospect, I wish I would have gotten like, I wish I would have got, in retrospect, I guess I wish, in retrospect, I guess I wish I would have gotten a large and then maybe it would have like shrunk down to be the perfect size. I don't know. It's not awful, but the sleeves really do drive me crazy. Like, look at that. Like, it's so short. So if I could somehow be able to make the sleeves longer and fix the hood, because this hood is just non-existent anymore. And then if I could fix this, this whole bulge here, I'm not pregnant. So if I could fix that, maybe the length, Stretch it down a little bit more. Okay, so we're gonna try this, and yeah, I'll let you guys know. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm gonna fill up the sink with lukewarm water, and hopefully it'll fit in my sink. And I gotta get um, conditioner. All right. It won't fit in this sink. I just put it in here. It's a little bit too big for the sink, so I guess I can try this tub. <laughs> That's probably good. I'm gonna get everything out that's floating. Hang on. All right, that's better. So I'm gonna get the conditioner. So I'm gonna put. <laughs> you focus on me. There you go. I'm gonna put in um, like a tablespoon. So we're gonna guesstimate here. Now I'm gonna mix it up because it's just kind of clumpy. See? It's clumpy. Oh my god, don't fall in, don't fall in, don't fall in. This is all I can't tell. This is quite the workout. It smells really good. This is like my favorite conditioner, so this better work. Here is the sweater. Now we are going to put this into the tub. You ready? Yeah. Oh, there it goes. It's in the tub. So it soaks in. Okay. Now I'm gonna set a timer for 30 minutes and ready, set, start. 
30 minutes and counting. So we'll see you guys in 30 minutes. It's been a little more than 30 minutes, maybe like a couple hours <laughs> because I had to make lunch. So anyway, here it is. It's pretty well soaked. I'm gonna drain the water and then wring it out. And then pretty much what I read was you then put it on a towel and then stretch it. See how this goes. <laughs> Oh, it's heavy. I put some towels on the ground here. I'm gonna put it on the ground and then we're gonna stretch it out. Still got a lot of water in it. Oh my gosh, it's so heavy. Let's change the angle here. So I'm gonna try to stretch it. So I laid it here, it's going to dry, and I will see you guys in a couple days probably. And we'll see how it turns out. Fingers crossed. It's been two days guys. I think it's dry. Should we go check on it? I think we should. Alright, let's do this. All right, guys, here we go. Let's get the sweater. It's still right here. It's dry. It, it's pretty dry. All right. I guess it still feels a little damp, but we're gonna try it. Moment of truth. I hope I stretched it at least a little bit. <laughs> okay. Cardi's right here. You ready, Cards? Are you ready? Are you ready? No? Maybe? I don't know. Here we go. Oh, it's definitely still wet. Oh, it's definitely still wet. Okay. We're gonna see if I was successful in stretching it at least a little bit. The zipper. Oh, that's better. A little bit, a little bit better. Sleeves. Go to about my arm. It's not bad. See this? This is still, oh no, this is better. I definitely think it's better, guys. What do you think? I stretched it a little. It's definitely better than it was. So moral of the story, don't wash your merino wool sweaters in the washing machine and definitely don't throw them in the dryer. Right? Right. It definitely stretched it out for sure. I do wish the sleeves were a little longer though. But they were short to begin with, I have to admit. All right guys, so thanks for watching. Um, Love it if you'd subscribe. That'd be pretty sweet. I'll see you on my next video. And if there's anything that you guys like want to see or anything, like, I don't know, any type of video, let me know. I'm always up for some new ideas. And yeah, okay, so bye.